Hi, this is Chris again with Mobile Experience. Today we're going to be reviewing two apps with end-to-end -end encryption, both Joplin Notes and Notes Nook. First, let's start with Joplin. Joplin can import Markdown files, their proprietary JEX files, as well as Evernote Enix files, their proprietary files. Joplin is free and open source software. Joplin is available on Windows, Linux, Mac OS, Android, and iOS. Another interesting feature is that Joplin offers note history or version history so you can, if you accidentally delete some data in a note, you can restore that note to a prior state. Joplin also offers a web clipper so you can clip web pages. Joplin also offers a traditional notebook and tag structure. Joplin actually comes with two text editors, which is kind of unique in the note-taking world. It has a markdown editor and a regular rich text editor. As far as syncing your notes go, Joplin is free and open source software. You can sync your data with OneDrive, or you can sync it with Dropbox. Another option they have available is a paid plan, and it is about $1.49 a month for their lowest tier. The next app I would like to talk about is Notes Nook. It also offers end-to-end -end encryption. Notes Nook is also fully open source software. The platforms available for Notes Nook are Windows, Mac OS, Linux, Android, and iOS. Notes Nook offers a text editor. Notes Nook offers a traditional notebook structure along with tags to help you find your data. Notes Nook export options include Markdown, HTML, PDF, as well as basic text. Notes Nook also offers note history or version history, if you will, to restore your note to a prior state. And finally, we come to plans for Notes Nook. Their basic plan, their pro plan, is $49.99 a year. Finally, between the two apps, I would have to pick Notes Nook. They offer more export options, which is very handy if you want to move your data to a different service. If you enjoyed this video and like to see other tech-related videos, please like and subscribe. Feel free to leave a comment, and thank you for watching.